Hi right, guys, and welcome back to Let's Play Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic 2! I finally uh, did a little off screen, and I go, What's my price? Achieving the best time is 500 credits. Uh, well, what's the point of. You have grown oh. strong in the Force. I can feel its touch upon you. Do not let the higher mysteries blind you to others. Turning away from that which tempts you or causes you fear is not strength. Facing it is. I have seen you display many acts of mercy, charity in our journey. Why? There's enough suffering. Even if it weakens those you help, even if it robs them of the strength needed to grow, you have been chased, hounded since our first meeting. And it has only made you stronger, more capable. Um, I fail to see how small acts of mercy can be harmful. Ah, then you have learned nothing. From such small things, from such critical points, the universe and its masses may be moved. That is why you must be careful in all that you do, and in every choice you make. Aiding them gives you strength by taking on their challenges, but weakens them. If that is your choice, then use their dependency, feed upon it, until you have exhausted them, then leave them. And I would view the ones you travel with much the same way. Well, they're loyal companions, they're all not harm them. And I will never abandon my friends in such a way. So you may think, but it will be best to strike first. Your allies are allies by circumstance, and they will not hesitate to do the same to you if you continue down your path. Influence lost. Light side points gained. Uh, this kind of came out of nowhere. Okay, then. That looks like one beat up Star Destroyer to me. Okay then. <laughs> Ooh. I wonder who that is. I have felt it too, my lord. A disturbance in the force. It was difficult to make out, my lord. At first it was such a quiet thing. I did not notice it. But now I wonder if it has always been there. I merely could not hear it before. The sound built so slowly, yet when you listen for it, you can make out the strains, even over the background life of the universe. Do you feel it is a... You... You are the darkness in which all life dies, my lord. All life exists to feed your power. And my life... My life is yours. I beg you, please. Echoes through the force. I can follow it to its source and bring it to you. I will leave it once, my lord. Hmm. Interesting. I think we're gonna get ourselves somebody to come after us. Anyways, I don't know why that gets into place. Kray's a jerk. We all know this now. <laughs> and that's like I said. That's mostly why my light side characters usually never 
got influence with her. I honestly don't think that helping people out will make them weaker because of it. I mean, they're true, there's some people who will only use you for your help, but that's when you have to make the decision to, to let them stand on their own two feet. I don't know. Yes. So, back to that cutscene with that Sith Lord guy. At least I assume he's a Sith Lord. He kind of looked like one. He's Was he holding that ship together? I mean, it looked like it was destroyed, and you could see the vacuum of space, but they weren't dying. Something happened. I don't know. Maybe he's using the Force. I guess we'll have to just wait and see and learn more about th that later. Alright, let's head over. Is this... Where, where is it? Yeah, here we go. Hello. So I have no business with the exchange. Get out of here. Home. Looks has sent me. Don't you know what you're getting into, human. You have listen to a human is here to see Slask. Everything checks out. Please open the door. <laughs> okay, I guess he runs away. Like a pans, eh? So let's go in. Unless I can. It's by appointment only. Okay. Let's go in. I'm not sure if there's another way to get in here rather than through Lux Luxa. I don't know. This is usually the way I get into here. So I talk to her and I get her to let me in. I'm almost positive there's probably another way to do it, but I don't know. I'm doing it this way. <laughs> it's not like you get dark points for it. I mean, you don't get any light points either, but... Mm. Okay, let's go around here. I'm terribly sorry, but there must be some sort of mistake. I don't have a record of your appointment. Are you certain it was for today? That's why I have been sent here. Perhaps the mistake is in the system. Well, if... very well. What was your name? Excuse me, Lopax Lusk's appointment has arrived. Please open the inner door. There you are. Have a good day. All right. Lopak Slusk should be with Okay. Hmm. Is there anything around here that I could make use of? Ah! There's a door over here. Oh, that one doesn't lead anywhere. Oh. An Athorian, huh? Have you come to torment me like the others? <laughs> no, why are you here? Perhaps you will free me. I was placed in here by two large Gamaronians, and I do not know the reason why. They have not fed me, and they will not allow me to return to my herd. How do I set you free? I'm not sure. I think the forest cage was operated remotely. There should be security panels somewhere. I'll see what I can do. Open this door. Of course, we know the Gamaronians from the movies. They were in Jabba the Hutt's palace. Pigmen. Yeah, eee, you've got a lot of nerve coming here, Jedi. It's bounty on you. Uh, we've got on your kind. What do you want? Here, representing Chodo Habat. You, what? I gave very specific instructions regarding that hammerhead and any of his cronies. Who let you the city in? Matu, bring me who's ever working at uh, the door. Uh oh, that's this foolish Jedi. With pleasure. Uh oh, spaghettios. Um, energy resistance. 
and don't want to attack the other guys, maybe? What the heck's Kray doing? She's just being dumb, huh? Stun him. Stun him. Stun him. Stun him. <laughs> there we go. Now go for the cure. Alright. Usually I have a much harder time with this fight, but... Yeah. We got him. Yes. Okay. I'll have to talk with her again later. Mid pack? I think he should have something. He should. Okay, well, there's a workbench. Bet you we're probably gonna have to go out here and fight those guards. Uh oh. They're not here anymore. Let's go talk to her. Please don't kill me. Should have picked a safer line. Uh, get out of here and I won't kill you. There, get her out of here. We don't want to kill her. Keep moving. Yes, I knew there's something. Benix Blaster. I bet you that's probably going to be good for uh, Atten. I should probably equip it on him. Back then, that's what I'm going to do. Mm -mm, heavy Blaster. Actually, I should probably put that in the, his proper hand. Eh. There we go. That's much better. All right. Cool. I hear you. Hello. <laughs> May not even speak basic. Just said you were strong. I'll get you inside. We will see how strong you are. Boss, Matu is here with Kubis from the door. You want to see him now? Yes, I'll send him in. What? Whoever let you get back here better be dead, or they'll be wishing they were when my droids are through with you. Uh oh, Spaghettios, droids. Well, let's try stun droid. Try again. Okay. <laughs> just, just chop him up. Found yourself well getting this far, but you should think things over carefully. I can be a very valuable ally. <laughs> so what is it you want? To join the exchange? Money? Just want you to leave the Athorians alone. Really? All this trouble just for that? Ah, uh, it seems we have some visitors. I was wondering when you'd show up, look so. Slusk. Assume this was all you're doing. I may have had a hand in this. Yes. Suppose they should have known. You always were an ambitious one. Enough with that, though. On to business at hand, I don't think it's possible that all of us will be leaving this room alive. Dun dun dun! We'll find out next time, guys, what's going to happen. Godspeed, stay frosty. See you next time. <laughs>